Deep learning has become an indispensable tool in a wide range of areas, including computer vision, robotics, natural language processing, and so on. In many cases, deep learning is also very useful for multi-object tracking, and it's even possible that deep learning will replace many of the techniques that we've learned about in this course, at least in some settings. We will provide a brief introduction to deep learning, starting with the first description in this video. You have probably heard about artificial intelligence, or AI, in the media, in books, and probably also in various movies. The objective in artificial intelligence is to build smart machines. Some also describe it as the effort to automate intellectual tasks normally performed by humans. These tasks could involve to solve problems, to have a conversation, or to drive a car. In many cases, these examples consist of pairs of input and output data, where the input data represent the situation and the output data describe a suitable solution. Machine learning is currently the most popular approach to artificial intelligence. Deep learning is a subfield of machine learning where deep neural networks, often with millions of parameters, are used to represent functions and thus to make decisions. In fact, most of the artificial intelligence systems that I believe that you've heard about in the media are using deep learning. Let's look at a small selection of the many topics where deep learning has recently had a huge impact. One of the first problems where deep learning enabled us to improve performance considerably compared to earlier state-of-the-art methods was speech recognition. The basic objective in this task is to listen to someone's voice and figure out what they say, which has a lot of important applications. Speech recognition is also closely related to the challenging and exciting area of natural language processing, where deep learning has had a big impact much more recently. As an example, deep learning has improved our ability to perform machine translation. A very important breakthrough came in 2012, when a Canadian research team used deep learning in a large-scale computer vision challenge called ImageNet. In the top five ImageNet classification challenge, there are 1,000 categories, and even though you have five chances to guess the correct class, random guesses would yield a lot of errors. One thing that was new in this challenge was that it contained more than 1 million classified images, and this meant that you had a lot of data that you could use for training your algorithms. The image to the right is not actually from ImageNet, but the object in this image is arguably a mountain bike, which means that our classification network handles this particular image well. When deep learning was applied to this problem in 2012, they managed to improve performance considerably compared to what used to be state-of-the-art performance. Since then, the performance has increased further, and since 2015, it can be argued that these networks do image classification better than humans. After the breakthrough with image classification, deep learning has had an enormous impact on computer vision, and has dramatically improved performance on a lot of computer vision tasks. One such problem is object detection, where deep learning is used to find and classify objects in an image. Since this problem is important for multi-object tracking, we return to this topic in later videos. Another impressive achievement took place in 2016, when deep reinforcement learning was used to beat the world champion in Go. Prior to this, people argued that the complexity of this game made it a grand challenge for machine learning, and it was expected to take many years to reach human performance. Apart from the examples mentioned above, deep learning is of course also used in a range of other fields, including medicine, chemistry, and finance. 